I chose higher maths because I've always been quite good with numbers and also higher maths is uh, essential for uh, me going on to university. Yeah, I'd like to get into courses in either engineering or in the finance sector, which maths you normally need to like, an A or a B at a higher level. To study higher maths you just need a pass at National 5, however if you get a C you might struggle with the workload of higher maths because it's quite a big jump. Candidates with uh, an A or B pass should be able to cope with uh, higher maths and get a good pass. In higher maths you follow your development at subjects that you've already covered covered at National 5, such as the straight line, vectors and uh, trig equations. However, you also go into new branches of math, such as differentiation and integration, which is key to a lot of the advanced maths further on you use maths, even if it's going to be at university or in a job. Uh, also, you use these skills in problem solving questions and maths, so they are really essential skills you're going to need to pass our maths. I quite enjoy maths because uh, it's only got a right or wrong answer, so you know if you've got it right or wrong, but also to get that answer, you can go around it loads of different ways, like there's not just one set way you have to do it, you can normally go through different methods to get the right answer, and also quite a lot of problem solving in it, and I quite like the idea of solving problems and getting that answer, it's quite rewarding. So there's a lot of content in the course, so there's a lot of stuff you've got to learn, a lot of layouts for the solutions or a lot of like problem solving. Also the, the homeworks uh, plays quite a big part in higher maths. They give you a higher portfolio which has got questions on each topic and you do that as you go. It's not set homework but if you're wanting to pass higher maths you should complete the portfolio and you'll do a portfolio test on it at the end of the, each unit and the teacher will see how you're getting on but if you're passing the portfolios it will stand you in good stead for passing the course. Higher maths is a challenging subject so you're going to need to be resilient, you're going to need to keep going, you're going to need to keep learning. Also, you're going to need quite good numerical skills, such as the basics, because when the problems get tougher, you're going to need to be able to do the basics quite well. So you're going to need to work really hard, because there's a lot of uh, content. So overall, if you keep doing something in maths, you'll normally get better at it. And so even if you're not that good to start with, if you can keep trying, then you'll succeed. By studying higher maths, I improved my problem solving skills. Uh, a lot of the questions do require a bit of problem solving. Also, I'd say my work ethic improved because uh, I had to do more work than I expected to make sure I passed the subject. Higher maths is a key subject for many areas. It will help you uh, to get into university, as I said, or it's essential to do subjects such as physics or other subjects and various careers. Higher maths could let you go into uh, careers in finance. It could also let you go into careers in engineering because engineering is all based around maths.